Hey everybody. All right, in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to create a delta wing. Uh, so this is kind of a special case of a swept wing because the leading edge has quite a bit of sweep. In fact, probably a lot more than most swept wings. And uh, it's pretty straightforward as well. So we're gonna go ahead and go up here and add our new wing. Once again, I'm gonna show the top view. And so we've already got some sweep here, but if you look at uh, a lot of like military fighter jets uh, that are delta wings, uh, they have a significant amount of leading edge sweep. So our sweep location currently, since it's set to zero, is at the leading edge. Uh, but I'm probably going to modify this to around 60 degrees. Okay, so that seems about like the amount of sweep that we want for the leading edge. Um, however, we want to modify the root cord of the wing now so that this extends much further back to be pretty much in line with where the tip is going to end up. All right, so to push this point back to here to mimic more of a delta shaped wing, all we have to do is modify our root cord. So I'm going to continue to increase that. Okay, that's a little bit too far for me. I want it to be, I want the trailing edge to be pretty close to a straight line. And I can zoom in a little bit here. And so the black line here is defining where, where that trailing edge is. And it's getting a little bit hard for me to get close to that. Um, so I'm going to decrease the sensitivity by clicking on this several times and so now I can kind of fine-tune this alright so that looks pretty good there and so as you can see if I shade my wing make it a little easier for you guys to see it looks pretty good this seems like a delta delta wing to me uh, one thing I might want to do to finish this up is just to clean up that tip So I go to my plan tab and I can select my tip cap type to be round. Okay, I like that. Now, once again, don't forget that hotkey R. Hit R, you see these green dots. Select one when it turns red and now I can rotate easier about that point and see what's going on with this tip. So I might want to increase the length of that have a little bit smoother transition so yeah that looks good I'm happy with that and you can also have this go to more of a, an actual point uh, you don't have to have the tip cord to be even that long if you don't want to that's as easy as going up to the section tab and just decreasing that okay pretty good with that now you'll notice when I did that though it did pull this towards the leading edge. So all I would have to do to resolve that is go back up to my top view, zoom in a little bit, and what did we do before? Well, we modified the root cord to take it out from around here all the way out here, so now we have to go back and decrease that a bit. All right, so that was pretty simple, right? So just uh, play around with it in those settings and you'll be able to match up what your specific uh, requirements are for your wing design. So hope that was helpful.